your favorites. Hell yeah. It's Alternative 101. So here we are. This is for um, all you Bloom fans. Uh, thank you so much for watching the show. Um, but this is a uh, behind the scenes content for you guys, a special theme. Where again, it's uh, here uh, October uh, 28, 2012. We're here at uh, Indie100.com's radio station with uh, my boy Jerry Daly, uh, DJ over there. Um, and uh, we got Zane Hewitt, uh, who plays. Uh, as you've seen, uh, Brody on the show, where uh, Ray Galuccio, who is the uh, the he is the puppet designer and uh, maker of Blue, as well as he, he does a he does actually a cameo in uh, in, the, in the second second episode. Yes. Yeah, and uh, we got uh, What's up, guys? Uh, my partner in crime here, Justin Galuccio, Hi. with Blue himself. How you guys doing? Smash your FM radio. Indy 100 rocks. I'm going to have some phenomenal, fantastic, and cool guests. They're going to tell you some cool stuff that you guys probably want to know about. Well, let me start turning the microphones on. I guess I'll start over here with this one guy that I happen to know. You know, is it a guy that I used to know? A guy that I actually do know. Mr. Superman, we used to call him a nickname, T2. That was, uh, because when you put two T's together, you had Tyrone Tan, the Superman. What's up, man? How you, you doing? Good hey, man, what's going on? How you doing, man? It's a long time. Well, you know what? We know that you're a accomplished director. You've been in the Guinness Book of World Records. You've got all kinds of films and stuff that you've done before. So now what brings you back here to the phenomenal place that I call the place that I don't like going? Work. <laughs> <laughs> well, aside from seeing you, Mr. Jer uh seeing you uh you know we're here um, we're here with a cast and uh people behind the scenes of a new web series we have a new comedy sitcom called bloob well hey man tell us what is bloob okay i see you got this for you guys at home or you guys at work and i know what's going on uh bloob and uh this is a show created and uh, executive produced by tyrone chan wait a minute it's like, like this Executive produced by Tyrone Tan. <laughs> With the echo. Yeah, uh, yeah. Basically, it's about a uh, a, a young boy uh, played uh, played by actor Zane Hewitt. His name he plays uh, Brody on the show, uh, and his other friend, uh, his best friend Derek, who plays by, uh, played by Justin Galluccio, and they befriend a alien named Bloob um, that comes <laughs> that, that comes from. Uh, Comes from out of space, and um, you know he's kind of a wisecracking, uh, smart aleck type of um, uh, character. Okay. Uh, why is that? Why is cracking? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. You know, actually, Bloob is in the in the studio with us right now. Oh, okay. Uh, that's he, the he, that's he, the funny looking thing with the eye, yeah, right? Yeah, that's the uh, Bloob. <laughs> yeah, Dave, man, thanks. You know. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, okay, I see you're you're like a okay, folks. For you guys, listen. I know this is radio. Um, thankfully, most of you can't see me because I look like hell. Um, but but uh, these guys have brought a camera in here, believe it or not, in a radio studio. Can you imagine? I didn't know. Well, across sitting from me, I've got this like alien thing. He's got like a like an antenna on top of his head, but the head is like kind of like a like imagine a blue football with an eyeball on it. Got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, that, that's what we're building on planet, man. That, that that's how it is. So what's oh. up, man? How you doing? All right. Well, not every day we get an alien in here. <laughs> you know, yeah. You know what? It, it, it's pretty impressive, but uh, you know, on, on, my, on my planet, we get aliens all the time. You know, humans now. That's interesting. That's, that's very interesting. But, mm. well, I, I'm enjoying it. Uh, my new web series, as I, it's so called, and uh, you know, I'm just out here promoting it, and you know, just trying to get things started, man. So when does the web series come on? It, it we just launched uh, th uh, last Thursday, uh, 8 p.m., and it goes on uh, every week Thursdays at Bloob. You could go to uh, www.bloob. Dot com, okay. and it's got a bunch of affiliated sites. The website also has a bunch of you have, you have merchandising you could buy. Connect with us, the fan mail, and all the stuff. It goes to uh, bloob TV, uh, bloob com. I'm sorry. Well, remember the last, the, last uh, the last old silent. That's what I, uh, Bloob would say. <laughs> yeah, right? yeah, the last old silent, and uh, plain and simple, I'm everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. He's pretty. Right, well, here we go. I'm gonna bring this up on screen. We'll see if we can uh, take a look here. Oh, oh look at that. You guys there can help me navigate through that. Oh, uh, technology, man. Well. Okay, uh, <laughs> second here. We got up on a screen Whoa. here. Uh, so, they got this thing. Okay, I, I see the whole thing. This is pretty cool. You guys got to check this out. Go to bloob.com and uh, check this out and uh, see if you can kind of find out what this is about here. So, you guys got to, okay, you're an alien guy. So, so when did you get here? I got here about, <clears throat> I think, 
About a month ago. About a month ago. Okay. Yep. 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 And which uh, which airport you come in through? Oh, uh, ain't ain't no airport, man. Oh, okay. Ain't no, but you just you you say, oh my god, I'm gonna crash land into the ground. Oh my god. And oh, okay. Then, then that's how it goes. Oh, so and you then, then you land safely. You didn't have to deal with the whole TSA thing. No, no, no. no she no. crash landed in Brody, uh, <laughs> aka uh, Zane Hewitt's, uh, yeah. aka his character Brody's Back pool. Yard. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right over here. Okay, so you uh, you deal with the uh, with Bloob. Are you oh, guys yeah. like friends, or how does it work? Oh, that's uh, that's to be announced. Uh, you know, he's as of right now, he's kind of a nuisance living in my house. But yeah. uh, you know, <laughs> yeah, he's a cool guy. A nuisance. Cool okay, yeah. what would you clarify a nuisance? What, what makes him a nuisance? Well, he looks know. pretty pretty low maintenance, you know. <laughs> he's, he's a good guy, but you know, he hey. just he pops in, you know, pops out of nowhere, you know, just lives in my house, you know, takes all my stuff. But uh, he's got magic a lot of. Magical he has a lot powers. of magical powers. Yeah, magical I mean, powers, man. Oh, he's got magic. So you gotta or, watch or out. not magic, got, but he's yeah. got a lot of powers. That yeah. uh, mystical power. Yeah. 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 Okay, well then that could be good. Yeah. So. Uh, for uh, language and things like that, do people at work need to wear headphones, or can they just? No, this is a family show, kind of. You know, it's a it's a family. Ba- I mean, basically, my my goal in the beginning of creating the show was to obviously showcase uh, Mr. Uh, Justin Gallucci. Okay, yeah, he's also yeah. here. Too. I, I'm here, right here. Oh, okay, uh, he's Hi. also uh, voices Bloob. <laughs> okay, um, and uh, we kind of came up with this character, and it was I wanted to go a throwback to the old '80s types sitcoms that we you know maybe me and you had grown up watching yeah, um so it, it's a you know like i said <laughs> but you know i, I kind of wanted to 100 years old yeah, you know, I, wanted to, I wanted to have those yeah. kind of uh, shows you know where it's family people could watch together and obviously the, the <laughs> online the online is so big for the younger generation that i wanted to develop something that uh you know people you know the young generation as well as us um our age bracket, uh, um, 80s people, um, could watch 80s too. People. I mean, because it was funny. Though, I t- 80s people.com. Old people driving, get in front of you. What are you going to do? 80s people.com. Um, because, you know, it's interesting. The first test screening we did was with like a six year old, you know, with, with six year olds and then like, you know, people uh, 30s to 40s. Year, okay. And every, I mean, the, the little, little ones were cracking up at the, at the, at the puppet, um, Bloop. Okay. And then the old, the older generation um, is cracking up at the jokes. Okay, now I heard it's the word puppet here, and I saw a little shrug of the uh, eye hey, here. Excuse me, uh, Tyrone, I'm oh, a fabricated American. That's right. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. He, uh, <laughs> in, even in, in, in the show, uh, he, we gotta he, clear that up. He, he, uh, he even Bloob says he looks like a puppet because he does, but that's his way of hiding well, out. Well, the P word is like cussing us out, uh, uh, us people out. So you got to use the word fabricated American. Mm. <laughs> yeah. So you got to use the F word instead of the P word. Yeah, so F A. Use the F word. Okay, I like, like that already. Because that's. Yeah. Appropriate. Sure. Ray Ray Galuccio, uh, man of jack of all trades, uh, he uh, designed and made the, the the puppet Bloop, or you know, in, in reality. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm actually responsible for all the madness that Bloop. Uh, it, you know, I brought him into existence. <laughs> so yeah. The start of the show was, I mean, of the created aspect of it was just to. I really wanted wanted something good in quality for the for the online content. Uh, nice. And so when I met, actually, I met Justin uh, not too long ago. And we just, you know, he was such a talented thing. I, I saw this doc, beautiful documentary, if anyone gets to see it, called Being Elmo. Being and, Elmo, okay. And, yeah, and when I saw that, there was a, a gentleman uh, who... Kevin, Kevin Clash. Kevin Clash, who Elmo. actually, who created Elmo, or, you know, who does a puppeteer for Elmo, uh, reminded me so much of this uh, young lad, Justin Gluccio, who's uh, only 15 and does puppeteering. And um, I said, you know, we got to do something and together and showcase this, this this talent of yours. And I had worked with Zane Hewitt. Zane Hewitt uh, claimed he needs to he, he needs to star on Desperate Housewives as well um, for several years. So uh, playing Parker Scarbo and I, 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 I um, he, he's a very dear heart to my heart and close, close, close family friend. He's pretty much my nephew in, in some degree. So um, you know, I thought I, we got to collaborate together to uh, create something for these guys to to be in. To work off, and then when we, me and Justin had created this uh, puppet character, um, Bloob, we it got we got inspired. I got inspired to write, yep. and then you know to do to, to do this show. So Tyrone, I just had a scary thought. I'm actually Bloob's father. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. no. So I mean, but yeah, just you know, so it, you know, watching that documentary, being Elmo, I I was like the the, the Justin Gluccio really, I thought um, was almost like a, a protege. To Kevin Clash, it was, it yeah, Kevin. yeah, yeah, and I and I got to meet. I had a, a good chance of meeting Kevin Cl- uh, Clash not too long ago, and he uh, let me try an ammo, and he was very nice. And uh, he said that uh, whenever I was, whenever I was in New York, 
you let me visit the Sesame Street workshop. So yeah. good wow. deal. Good deal. So you know, we wanted to create a an original character. Okay. That, you know, so that's the thing. I you know something that we we have you know like a, an own kind of puppet type you know, but for for kids to enjoy. But not only that, but the sarcasm and the wit of um, that adults could love. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Well, let me ask you. What's your? Uh, you ever play Alien vs. Predator? The game? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you know, I haven't played the game, but I've seen the movies, man. You've seen the movie? I've seen the movie. Okay. Well, I'll tell you, we're going to take a quick music break, and we're going to play Aliens vs. Predator from Machinima, and we'll be right back with Blue. What's up, guys? How are you feeling right now? I detected, uh, how are you feeling? Hey, I'm feeling good, Tyrone. Uh, just got through getting a little talk with the radio station and getting interviewed. It's actually kind of fun and pretty cool, so... I want to thank Tyrone very much for letting us do this. this is Aliens vs. Predator from the Machinima Guys. You're back here on the 101 Show. I'll turn to the 101 on the Indy 100. It's Jerry D sitting across the way from Tyrone Tan and Bloob himself. You know what? If you haven't checked it out already and you're sitting there at work and you might be blocked, you can go to StarosEntertainment.tv. And that's spelled S-T-A-U-R-O-S Entertainment.tv. You got any, anything else where if somebody's blocked from YouTube, is there a way they can see it? Uh, our, our dear yeah, friends yes. across the street over here yeah. at uh, 500 yeah. South Buena Vista can't get YouTube. <laughs> wow. Okay, uh, then you could go to blip dot, uh, blip dot, uh, blip dot TV. Yeah, blip, B-L-I-P dot TV, and you could just type up blue, B-L-O-O-O-B, or you could go to uh, stay tuned TV dot net. That's S-T-A-Y-T-U-N-E-D tv.net and type up bloob again um, or star wars entertainment.tv um, and then uh, yeah or obviously uh, bloob.com you should um, be able to just type in bloob to like a search browser okay and then it should uh, just show all the urls that bloob okay you know. well you know what here mr zanyu that's why i have to bring him here to the show <laughs> all right let's he, hear that again I, I am from that younger generation so, I mean. <laughs> that might work because we're old 80s people <laughs> 80s. 80s people. <laughs> We're like cave people, but 80s. Yeah. So how do we do that again? Uh, well, it's just a it's a possibility. Uh, just type in Bloob. That's B L triple O B into like uh, maybe Google or any other search browser, and uh, it should show. Uh, <laughs> he just said the magic word, folks. <laughs> it should show show all the URLs that Bloob's on. So. Okay. Yeah. Tyrone Tan, it's it's phenomenal to have you in here. I, I've got the blue man over here. I want to see if we can get him to do some stuff for us here on, on the air. Let's go, blue. And uh, you might have to look up at the screen here. I'm going to give you the next song here, and we'll, maybe we'll have you call it off. It's going to be C number nine up there. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's too far for you to look to be able to. Inner alien? Yeah. I want to have you call it off, man. I want you to go ahead and tell tell who it is and what it is and what it's going to play. Rhythm of Mars. In an alien with the rhythm of Mars. Is that good? I think it is. Uh, it's good. I think that'll fly. I think, yeah, I don't know. Atta boy. Thanks, man. <laughs> No pop music here. Alternative. It's my music. Alternative. 101. There we go. We had the corny music. We put the sounder in there. We got all the stuff. We got a live guest. We've got a fabricated American right here in the studio. <laughs> I never thought I'd say that. It's all good. It's all good. All right. It's all good in the neighborhood. We've had them all now. We've definitely had everybody. So what you guys can't see, for you guys that are blocked and stuff like this, I'm really sorry for you guys that are working out with my NBC Uni folks. I'm sorry. Um, I know that uh, they said you guys were screwing off too much listening to the show. <laughs> so I'm glad they didn't block the stream, only the websites we seem to point to. <laughs> <laughs> so, and also thank you guys at the IT uh, over there at NBC Uni for keeping us live. I really appreciate that. And we get the email, so we do appreciate it, folks. Um, a show created by the executive produced by Tyrone Tan, the super man. <laughs> All right. Thank you, sir. If you don't know who Tyrone Tan is, definitely look him up on IMDb. The guy does some incredible, way out, crazy stuff. Now, you know I do projects and stuff like that on the side that I don't very much talk about on this show, but this guy takes an approach that I would never take. You know, the man did a movie in one take. I mean, he has done some pretty amazing stuff that you tell people, like, oh, no, that couldn't be, and you'll usually win. Like, as a matter of fact, I'm wearing my Champs shirt right now from the, um, the bartender at Champs. Made a bet. Or some of the knowledge that I may not have had about the uh, entertainment industry, 
And um, let's just say I'm wearing his shirt. <laughs> <laughs> so I wear it as, as often as I can so I can do a little laughing uh, when I go out. So, folks, uh, let's definitely talk about this. It's going to be on Thursdays at uh, 8 p.m. Pacific. So you guys are uh, tuned in to the East Coast. You're going to get it before a little bit. A uh, few of us are here. But um, they're going to have it uploaded and ready to go. Okay, so what kind of merchandise can they get? Uh, they get uh, yeah, right on? now. They could get, or you know, Everything. we got the hats, we got T-shirts, hats, we got t-shirts. water bottles. Uh, water bottles. Uh, this is coming with the water in it. Yeah, purse, purses. Um, we're we're working on hopefully having the actual uh, the good, toy, toy, toy stuff coming out soon. Yeah. So. Oh wow, no kidding! Nice. So we're gonna be, uh, you know, there's like I said, we're all wanting to build up the fan base first. Okay. And uh, you know, and then uh, go from there. So we got a lot of stuff in the works already. Little okay. mini yeah. bloops. That's kind of scary. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be very oh, cool. Yeah, Why not for true. Christmas, man? That'd be awesome. Yeah. And before I forget, before I forget, I want to give. A a big shout out to our man. Uh, he's he's doing some behind the scenes stuff for our site as well. Uh, behind the scenes, yeah. Uh, Christopher G. Yes. Contreras, Woo! he's in the studio doing some behind the scenes. Uh, uh, he's also uh, works on the show production, but we also oh, no kidding. He's also uh, oh, doing, so he's all professional. Yeah, no, but he's also uh, we get him a uh, his, his uh, one of his uh, kind of debut acting as a, he's, we're giving him a guest or role. Guest oh, star nice. Role in episode two, which you got to check out. He's playing Agent Number One uh, agent. because there's there's, gonna, there's the government agents after. Blue, yep. so there's oh, no. a little bit of uh, you know. Did not pay his taxes? <laughs> no, I didn't, man. I didn't. So, but, but yeah, that'll so, get you. Yeah, so Christopher G. Contreras, we want to say thank you for uh, being here. But also, if you want to hit him up on Twitter, I told him I'd do this for him. Uh, Good. Hit him at that Beta seventy six on Twitter. Beta seventy six. That's B E. T A seventy six on tw- uh, Twitter. Uh, That's for Christopher G Contreras again. You can see him on this coming uh, Thursday's eight p.m. Uh, show, uh, episode two of Blue. Uh, episode number two. Yeah. I have a group on Facebook called Young Puppeteers of the World. Oh, say that again. Oh, wow. Young uh, Young Puppeteers of the World. Young Puppeteers of the World. I can't even spell puppeteers. <laughs> I know it's, it's it's a hard word. It's hard. Uh, but no, I um, you couldn't you couldn't pick something to, to like normal dummies like me could pick. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> well, you know you know hey it's us kids and getting together. Uh, uh, creating a, a, you know, just a puppet community. Uh, okay. Me, me and my friend Melvin Campbell, who's in uh, Illinois. Okay. <laughs> uh, in Illinois. And uh, me and him just created this thing for young puppeteers to come together. And they have been a really big support of Bloob. And uh, they, they have been telling me they want a Bloob doll. They want a Bloob doll. They want a Bloob doll. Spreading the word. Yeah, pretty much. Wow. And also, I have one, I think, if I can. Yeah, um, please. We're also part of Star Cars. I, uh, we built a Pee Wee Herman replica bike. Wait, a Pee Wee Herman replica bike? <laughs> yeah, it's yes, awesome. Yes, we did. Uh, Tyrone Stewart, it's actually, he gave us a seal of approval. We're okay. going to be at Long Beach uh, November 3rd, the Huracan. We're part yeah, of Long a group Beach. called Star, okay. Car- Star Cars. Uh, nice. They, they're the guys with the Batmobile, Back to the Future. Um, and we'll be there as the honey of Corona also. Uh, oh, okay. To get more support for, for next year. We're already thinking about next year and we're not done with this year yet. So yeah. Okay. So it's the haunting of Corona. Yes. Uh, give out the address and stuff like that. I'll check and see our, what our demographics are in Corona, but I know there's people there. So, hey, why not? <laughs> in the middle of nowhere. But, yeah, it's uh, the honey of Corona.webs.com. Okay. And also on the email, you can hit us up, the honey of Corona. Dot, uh, sorry, the honey of Corona at ca.rr.com. Okay, and if C-A-R- you're old, exa- rr.com. And if you're old school like us, the phone number is 951-768-0296. Nobody likes to talk to each other anymore, So, but that's a phone number. But us, sometimes it's us, easier that way. For us 80s people. The 80s people, <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's a web series. How long does the web series run? Uh, right now, we got the first four up. Uh, first four up that's going to be airing, and then we are in the process of still filming for the rest of the season. So uh, we already, you know, the first two are... First one is already up. Second one's coming up. Then we got two more, um, and then we we went on a break, and then we are in about a week or so going to be filming the continued saga of a bloob. Why are you so, continuing bloob. saga? I like yeah, that. So it makes it sound so dramatic. You know, bloob was being a diva. We had to talk to his people to make sure that. Yeah, bloob you know, was yeah, you know, I gotta, I gotta go to space <laughs> back here. And it's just big, too much travel time. So you know. Yeah. Okay. So you're doing the whole thing. So let me ask you, kid. The plane, the your your craft crash lands on this planet. Yes, sir. As backward as it is. Yeah, I know. And, it, and it, <laughs> what were you doing in this neighborhood? What were you looking for? You slumming? Oh, oh, no, 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 dude. You know, I, I, I was. I, we, we, we come down here uh, from our leader reps to observe and learn you humans because you guys got some. Interesting things on this planet. Oh, really? And we're trying to save Rod from destruction. Okay, from destruction. Yeah, so we might blow have to blow it up if it uh, if we don't have some better <laughs> stuff on the planet. So. Oh, okay. Well, we're trying to do that here too. <laughs> okay, well, and, <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. And uh, so you know, and I just end up crash landing into his pool, which is uh, Brody. Brody, which is uh, AKA yeah, Zane, played by Zane. You Brody, okay. And uh, so, and then you know, uh, my spaceship crash landed in the bottom of his pool. 
So now I can't, my person can't go to the microphone. Anyway, so uh, I crash landed into his pool, and uh, you know, then I need his help. This story and sounds back. somewhat contrived. I think he did I this on purpose. <laughs> 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 Yeah, so, and then uh, Brody's, uh, Zane Hewitt's uh, character, Brody, pretty much, and Derek, obviously, uh, come uh, try to, uh, well, you want you, I want you to say what your character's doing. Uh, well, my character's Brody, and uh, he's kind of like the cool kid. Uh, he's friends with Derek, uh, they're best friends, and uh, he has a band. Uh, Bro- a Brody band? does, Brody does, he has a band. Okay, what yeah, instrument does Brody play? Well, uh... Brody is a jack of all trades. I can just no. I was saying he he plays uh, he plays the guitar. Okay. He sings. All right. And he's just you know a general. Uh, he's he's just he's a he's a cool guy, man. He's 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 like the cool kid of the school. Okay. And um, I mean, oh sorry, I got the mic. Gotta fix the microphone there. There we go. I know where. There we go. Look at that. It's like a little arm. Yeah. Up and down, up and down, up and down. No. There we go. But, uh, okay. Well, that's another advertiser we won't mention right now. But go for that. <laughs> we can't keep it up when you need to go where it's going, right? Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Man. But uh, bro, he like um, he obviously the alien Bloop shows up, and uh, I think when Bloop does show up, his parents are gone. Yeah, his Bro's parents are gone. So the... he's home alone. How convenient! Point. Yeah, yeah, and then uh, there, he, I'm, he I'm tells... about to say what happens in the second episode, but uh, yeah, well, he he, he uh, obviously his best friend is Derek. He confides to Derek, and actually, <laughs> I I might have a role in the uh, in the show. He plays, I played oh, yeah, the, yeah, I played yeah. I played Jared the pool man who actually, Jared the pool man. <laughs> the pool guy. Okay. <laughs> who, who I plays Jared who uh, actually accidentally or you know kind of stumbles into. Uh, this situation last minute, and so they kind of have to confide to me, and I'm kind of like the older brother type figure that maybe helps this, uh, you know, Bloob kind of stay away from uh, which episode two is coming up. Will be uh, on the lookout. The spoiler government, alert. the yeah, the spoiler, <laughs> yeah. the government officials are already on the prowl for Bloob. Wow. Okay. Well, which is also so you got government officials looking for Bloob already. How did they find out he was there? It's oh, the government, well. man. <laughs> you know, yeah. Seriously. They know everything. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. They, know they got everything. your cell phones and all that kind of stuff <laughs> yeah. already going. Yeah. Again, uh, guest starring uh, Christopher Contreras as Agent One Number One with Arsene Shabazian, Zach Self, and Steve Raven. They're going to be uh, guest starring on the next episode, which is uh, where it, everything starts to pick up. Uh, with the show, uh, because the first show was establishing Bloob and you know his character and the characters, and now by second one it starts kicking in, uh, what's going to happen? So uh, mayhem, mayhem ensues. Yes. Yep. Mayhem yep. ensues. Yep. 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 <laughs> Not bad. So um, once again, you got your thing for Halloween. Let's uh, let's hear about that real quick there. And it's uh, the Haunting of Corona dot webs dot com. Again, if you need to, if you want to call old school, uh, uh, area code is now nine five one seven six eight zero two nine six. Okay. One, once again? Oh, uh, uh, seven, uh, sorry, God, 714. 951-768-0296. Okay. And uh, the web website again? Oh, the, the website's thehauntingofcorona.webs.com. Okay, so Thursday, 8 p.m. Yeah. Go to www.bloob, B-L-O-O-O-B.com. You could go to www.staytunetv.net, type up bloob. Uh, or go to blip, www.blip.tv, uh, type up Bloob there. You could go to www.starosentertainment.tv. That's S-T-A-U-R-O-S, entertainment.tv. And also, again, connect and hit, hit us up. We want to c- touch base with our fans, get more interactive. You could go to uh, Facebook and then uh, backslash uh, Bloob, the web series. Yeah. Um, on Again, uh, that's B-L-O-O-O-B.com. That B L O O B. Yeah. And uh, you know, we also is. Do we have time to give, give a couple shout outs? Yeah. Come okay. on, man. We got we got three minutes. Let's okay. burn it. We, we want we want to shout out to all the cast and crew of Bloob. Um, and you know what? We got a, speaking of guitar. Uh, we got a, a another uh, family friend, uh, Chris uh, Christian McLeod. Christian McLeod, who's in a band called uh, Wild Charge. I believe it's called Wild Charge. And, okay. Uh, check them out on Facebook. Check them out. They're 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 they're, they're family friends, and um, we wanted to give a shout out to. To uh, a lot of our family, the Del Mundo family, the Tan family, Contreras family, um, the Hewitt family, the DeVore family, um, the Galuccio family. Common spelling. Yeah, <laughs> the yeah, go- yeah. Oh, Common right. spelling. Yeah, okay. um, but there's so many people, uh, you know, uh, we just want to say thank you. And thank, of, of course, uh, Mr. Jerry Daly. And, uh, oh, Indy, don't worry about and, that. I'm here every day. And, that's uh, that's Indy, nothing to clap for. Tip your waiters over here. <laughs> Indy100.com. Thank you so much for this as well. Yes, definitely, um, definitely. Um, anything, anything, Justin? Uh, you got, you got, you're involved with a bunch of puppet stuff. Yeah, uh, I want to, I want to give a big shout out for their inspiration, uh, Swazzle. 
And okay, well, we'll say it like it's a shout out. Okay, hey, uh, Swa- uh, I want to give a shout out to Swazzle.com. Oh, uh, well, that's cool. Uh, Swazzle.com, uh, the Young Puppeteers of the World, uh, Puppeteers Unite, Discord Puppets, all those guys. Come on, come on, come on. Do it like the radio guy. Oh, Kevin Clash, uh, Swazzle, <laughs> Puppeteers Unite, and uh, yeah. Be like puppeteers unite. And Justin, you, do, com, you do a right? bunch of. Uh, he does. Justin does a lot of puppeteer websites. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, go to YouTube.com. Check out Sam Ham. He is a, another puppet that I built, and uh, he does. Sam Ham. Yeah. He does. <laughs> okay. usual, he does a usual pig blog. Check that guy. Check him out. Uh, at puppeteer Ham. It's all done in my house, little studio. And Gonzo. Oh, and I do Gonzo the Great at Comic Cons and stuff like that. He is at facebookcom slash Henson. Wow. That doesn't sound too bad. Yeah. Yep. Uh-oh. I guess we're running out of time here. <laughs> and again, check out uh, Beta76. That's our, uh, our, our our boy right here oh, yeah. doing camera work. Beta76 <laughs> Beta on Twitter. Yeah, Beta76, Twitter.com. Or, or, or yeah, Twitter. Yeah, on Twitter. Uh, if you, if you want to hit him up. You know what? We, we said we was going to give I promised him a shout-out and to help him plug that. Uh, Go for it. 20 uh, seconds. Yeah. So, uh, and, and Chris, 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 give us a mic. Anything, anything you want to say? This is uh, Agent Number 1. He's going to be appearing number 2. What, what do you got to say? Oh, no, I just, uh, just watch Bloob and... Go for it, go for it. <laughs> They're oh, having okay. a fight. Uh, no, just watch Bloob, and I just want to thank uh, everyone for checking out the interview, and thank you for having us on. All right. And I think we're out. Oh, man, I'm glad to see you again. You too. We're working. Yes, we're working. Thank you. Thank you very much. Accomplished director of man in the Guinness Book of World Records. <laughs> yes. Nobody believed me, but I got the shirt to prove it. Tyrone Tan, yes. Thank you. Thank you. You get the card, honey. Hey, Jerry, good meet you, bro. Hey, good to meet you, man. Any afterthoughts right now? Any? Uh, oh no, was, uh, we met the the great Jerry. Yeah, man. Outstanding, great, outstanding, outstanding. Awesome. Right now, Had a great uh, time, man. Zane, uh, any afterthoughts after just coming on the radio? Dude, I've never done this before, so this is a really cool experience. <laughs> man, I enjoyed it. It's good working with you, man. This is awesome meeting Jerry. We had a great time. Blue got to say a couple words. Yeah, Jerry's <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Check it out. Indy 100. Your favorites. Hell yeah. It's Alternative 101.